Hey guys, it's Alex. I have um, a haul video to share with you guys. It has it has uh, lots of small things from a bunch of different random places. Today is the official first day of the kids' summer vacation. It's June 2nd. I No, it's June 3rd. <laughs> yeah, today's Wednesday, June 3rd. Um, I uploaded a video this morning that's been sitting on my memory card from a couple weeks ago. So I did upload a different video, but this stuff, I've gone to Goodwill a few times, Dollar Tree a couple times, Walmart, Michaels. So it's little things, but from random, you know, different random places. I got some coffee to drink, and we're going to get started. So over the weekend, my sister came to visit us. And we went yard sailing, and usually I don't really find much at yard sales. I find stuff for the kids, but not myself. Um, but this time I found some stuff. So one sale had these, these stickers. She had lots more, but she had them priced at 25 cents a pack. So I only brought these up to her. And um, then when I got there, she says, how about a dollar for everything? And I was like, oh, okay. So... Instead of paying, you know, a quarter a pack, I just paid a dollar for everything. So, um, yeah, so I got those at one yard sale. And then I got this for free at a different yard sale. The kids had found some stuff, and I picked up this pen that I saw. And they are like, oh, you can have that. <laughs> oh, okay. And then the only other thing, I got this for 50 cents. This case, this is one of the Disney guys. I forget which movie it is, so, um... I can see his face, but I forget the movie. But I thought it was a DVD case, and I opened it, and it's like these little pouches. And she said it was sold like for marker storage, and I was like, heck yeah, I'm gonna buy it for my pens and pencils and whatnot. So I, yeah, I bought that for me, <laughs> and it was 50 cents. So yeah, yeah, I was gonna say there's the zipper. Um, so that was the yard sales over the weekend. Then I went to, I, I was watching Kim's video, Kimbo Creations, and she was saying that the some of the $1.50 bin stuff was now $0.50. Cents, and I remembered a few things that I liked there, so I stopped by Michael's. And I had found a few of them. And then I, let's see, like, I don't know, maybe a month ago, I found some new Project Life stamps. And in that section there was still a bunch of pegs that hadn't, the merchandise hadn't been hung up yet. So I just wandered back that way to see if it was put out. And lo and behold, they had the, um, me and my big ideas. I keep saying we are memory keepers. Me and my big ideas, um, that's why you couldn't find it when you looked it up, Brianna. It's not we are memory keepers. Um, they're, they're planners. So I was like, oh my gosh, because no matter what planner that I looked for, um, in the store, none of them besides that Erin Condren one that is like pre-order right now and it's super duper expensive in my opinion, um, none of them had the, the morning, the afternoon, and the evening that I was looking for. So when I opened this up and I saw that, I like gasped and I was like, oh my, thank gosh, because... I really wanted to have one, and I didn't want to pay the money um, <laughs> for those that other planner. Even though they're so nice, I just didn't want to pay for it. So I used a 40% off coupon, and that was another bonus, is that you could use coupons there. And they have so many cute little things to go with it. But when I got it, you know, nothing was on sale. So maybe another time when it's on sale or when I'm back with another coupon. But... It's pretty plain inside, color-wise, because I want it to be able to do it up myself. But um, these pages are, like, the intro to the month are decorated. And then they have these for each month. So, I'm sure lots of you have um, seen this before. I really didn't think my Michaels would um, get it. <laughs> so... Yeah, really cool. They have lots of other cool ones. Um, well, not lots. They they might have it, but um, it was slim pickings at my Michaels. So, but anyways, and then I had gotten this Heidi Swap um, planner stamp set 
from Michaels. And I think that's, yeah, that was it from Michaels. Okay. So this is from, oh, this, this is from Target here. These are kind of random. We found this um, Olaf and Anna and Elsa pen. Then these little Hello Kitty ice cream stickers. And then this booklet. I had seen this booklet one time. One lonely little book bit, booklet. But in the front of it, stickers were taken out of it. And I never saw it again. And I was kind of bummed because they have similar booklets like this uh, that are Hello Kitty and other brand or other characters that are in by the cards and like party supply section that are like three and four dollars a book. And this is a dollar. So. I'm glad I found that again. So that was it from Target. Well, the kids got a couple of things, but that was all I picked up. And then these are random things from Walmart. This I got a couple of weeks ago. Was a it's a bigger um, it's a five by seven photo album because I did this here with a smaller one, and I put some stickers inside. So, and I wanted to do it to this one because there's lots of sticker sheets. Well, there's quite a few, like, for example, this. Well, this as a whole sheet wouldn't have even have fit in here, but some of them I had to cut down to fit. So, <clears throat> I got this to see how the how it would work. And I made my own cover and, you know, took out the, the old one. And then I also found this at Walmart. This was with the graduation stuff on how to decorate your graduation cap, but it was a dollar ninety-seven, and I want to say I went to one of the times I was at Target. One roll of the glitter tape, just one roll. I think it was the spritz stuff, like in the um, party supply stuff, was four dollars. So I thought a dollar ninety-seven for two was pretty good. <laughs> so I grabbed that. And then they have some, um, before they had these little duct tape, um, but they were like little small rolls of duct tape, but now they have some washi. So I saw these two, and I grabbed these. There were lots of different ones, but they're like $1.44 each. So I just stuck with these two for now. And then this was on clearance. This scotch big one was $1.25 instead of like 4 bucks. That was from Walmart as well. And then I got these from Walmart. They were 97 cents. And I found these. And this was a different time when I went. If I have to go, at, you know, for whatever. I like to buy this flavored water that's there. And only Walmart has it. And they only have it, or and they have it in a 12 pack for like cans of water. Um, the like, you know, the carbonated water. So every time I go, like once a week, I'll go to get the, the water and I'll look each time I go to at the stickers and stuff. And I usually end up picking up a couple here and there. I love the flamingo. That was new. And they didn't even have like these two weren't even hanging up in the sticker, sticker aisle. They were on an end cap um, by the cards and like Father's Day stuff. They had a couple of Father's Day ones too. I got this one. Because I want to do in my little planner for August, a back to school thing. And then they had this, like in the craft section, where they have glitter and, um, like, the, just in the kids' craft section. These were 97 cents. I like some of these. So that was Walmart. And let's see, I showed that. Um, just a few little small things from Dollar Tree. I also, we took my sister to Dollar Tree and we got a couple of things. Um, got a um, pack of these pens. And this washi tape. Well, it's not really like washi tape. Their tape is different. Um, I found another pack of these calendar stickers. At first, I was like, mm, I don't know because we don't do lots of sleepovers or go to a lot of parties or we've gone to the zoo like one time never been to the aquarium so I was like I don't know about these but then because I thought it was going to duplicate itself like each sheet was going to be the same but when I opened it up on the other one I was like oh look at these like appointment game test date night 
vacation, shopping. No, I've never been on a vacation either, but <laughs> cupcakes, class event, there's the pencils, field trip, volunteer, teacher conference. And then these, look at these. So I was like, oh wow, when I saw these, I was like, I want to get another pack for a dollar to get all of these. Oh, and look at this, look how cool. I went to go flip up my calendar to June when it, when June 1st came. And my husband brings me calendars that his, um, the different reps that he deals with at work, they give him like calendars, t-shirts, pens, things like that. And he always brings me a calendar. Well, this is the first year that in their calendar, they put calendar stickers, like reminder stickers for things. And I was so excited when I saw this. I gasped. I was like, oh my gosh. Look, look, hair and nails, anniversary, party, special event, dentist, vacation, day trip, auto service, no school, back to school, tax payment. Oh Lord, I just wrote that check. Oh, my quarterly taxes. Oh my God. Delivery. Swimming pool service. So I was like so excited. I got free stickers. <laughs> okay, so that that part. And then we picked up these. And these are those translucent stickers where they kind of go over whatever. And I just love the cats that were in here, especially that one. And then there's this one with the different smiley faces and stuff. And then I picked up this um, reading thing for I had picked these books up it was funny I picked these books up for Bianca <clears throat> got that one and this one for her um, to do over the summer and her teacher sent her home with so much crap <laughs> I wouldn't even have had to buy these um, and then this one's for Gabriel and then I found these two for Gabriel so that was Dollar Tree. And then the last stuff that I have is some stuff from Pay by the Pound Goodwill. Take some of my coffee. Now, I went, I've gone quite a few times. I would do my work, I would do it late at night or get up real early and do it before the kids got up so that I knew I could have free time in the couple of hours that Gabriel was at his um, pre-kindergarten class. So I would go to the Goodwill and spend a couple hours there. But So from the pay by the pound part, I got this makeup case. It's a makeup traveling case. I saw this exact one actually in my grocery store in their makeup section and it's $12.99. But I got it and pay like nothing for it. So I stuck some stickers in here to show you guys an example of um, what you could do besides besides makeup so I got that from the Goodwill I found this little wallet I just thought it was cute so I grabbed that I also had I found a backpack um, a Jansport backpack I washed that up it's on the top of my dryer I let it air dry and then I had pulled out this coach purse and I was like walking to one of the chicks that I know I was like do you think this is real it's really hard to tell sometimes with them and she's like, yeah, I, I think so. And she's like, I could sell it. And I was like, well, in my head, I'm like, well, good for you, but I ain't giving it to you. <laughs> you know, like I found it. So I was looking, I was like looking on the inside, making sure I always look in the pockets, make sure there's nothing funny because I found some weird stuff in purses. <laughs> um, and then also make sure there's no holes in the lining or anything. Cause even though it's paid by the pound, you still don't, you know, you don't want to buy something with like holes in it but anyway so I opened the zipper pocket on the inside and there was a $20 bill on the inside of that purse I was so excited so that paid for like three days of um, Goodwill shopping since I since it's pay by the pound you know so yeah but that purse is on top of my dryer too because I was washing it then I found this and this is an old daytimer student planner it's it was brand new um, Bianca she's very interested in me messing with like calendars and stuff and she likes to do that kind of stuff and yes this is from 2000 but um I don't know I was thinking I could do something for her or just let her mess with it I don't know I don't know what I'm gonna do but because it you know they weigh like nothing 
but they're so expensive I figured I'd get it and even if I threw away the inserts and replaced it with something I don't know but yeah I thought that was a cool find and I had just come from the the retail part where they you know it's like a regular Goodwill and they had a um, oh the uh, Covington what is that one? Oh, you know what I'm talking about but they wanted fifteen fifty six or something like that for for the planner and then I walked into the pay by the pound and I found this one I was like yes score then I found this um, home and finance built organizer these they sell at Dollar General they're like 250 but like I said it's pay by the pound and it doesn't it won't cost that much and yes it's like 2009 10 and 11 but this part here that you put your bills on is not dated so this can come out and then you can use this as a template to make your own cover so or you could or you don't have to take it out you could just put paper over it if you want but anyways I thought that was cool, kinda cool so I found that then I found these two after I bought Gabriel's books at Dollar Tree for um, for him found this and I found this big binder to get ready for kindergarten it has all kinds of cool stuff in here Got that and I got Bianca actually a bunch of books because she was saying she needed more reading books because she had read most of hers like a few times then I found this and I had to fix the frame but it was the only thing I, I was about to leave and they had brought new stuff out and out of all the stuff this was the only thing that I found so it's the only thing that I paid for um, and it, it cost me 47 cents and it's this big like shadow box of a ship and see this the frame how it's kind of loose I have to like hot glue it back down um, and fix it and I'm gonna put it in my bathroom because my bathroom has like nautical type stuff in there so that's one thing I found and then I found this was kind of random just thrown in like the bins of books that they bring these stickers found this. and I don't have them with I think I put them away but people donate I don't know why they do it they donate coloring books that the kids have already scribbled in like I would just throw it away honestly um, but they donate them and inside some of the coloring books are pages of stickers and none of these guys there none of the girls there they're not gonna buy the coloring books they're already colored in they're already used so I just ripped see like this was ripped out I ripped out the sticker pages and I just bought the sticker pages only oh here's one book that I bought her Froggy's Halloween one. and I found this this is another like traveling makeup type case that you could use for other stuff stationery pens pencils whatever you want to use it for I thought that was pretty then oh this was in the books as well brand new pack of stickers then I know these are Dollar Tree brand but since um, I guess they took them from the front store from the retail part and they put them in the pay by the pound part um, these I'm pretty sure these are the Dollar Tree logo yeah it even says Greenbrier see they're selling it for more than Dollar Tree even sells it for it's a damn shame but anyways um, since they were paid by the pound I grabbed them those are all those socks and then this wasn't pay or this wasn't Dollar Tree but they're brand new so I grabbed them for Bianca and they let's see they wanted 216 for them in the regular store then I found this um, Kodak camera bag in the pay by the pound part my mom got me a camera for Christmas and I don't have a bag and I was at Gabriel's graduation trying to be very careful in carrying the camera um, and it's a bigger camera so I'm gonna hopefully see if it fits in there it's a nice little bag then the last thing that I found was this Marc Jacobs um, standard supply and it says it's the workwear type kind of bag so that was the last thing that I found and that is everything guys so yeah thank you guys so much for watching um, if you have any questions about anything leave them below and I'll talk to you guys soon bye